so what is going on one and all we are back with another episode to be honest i've done this episode before i've recorded it but like the last episode episode seven this whole thing is going to shit at the moment so my recordings have been absolutely poor so i'm going to make this a shorter episode so i'm not going to muff around too much we're going to do some upgrades for our people maybe get some suit tech improve our focus enemies detected with a scan are automatically tagged that's cool focus rewarded by abilities is increased by 10 percent focus and we've got some venom skills which we can now put on as well i think let's do it so how many skills have we got okay we got two so we can do l1 and triangle l1 and x with p that's pretty cool supposedly there are some new suits we've got the into the spider vest new r suit which you can't buy yet and nothing else at the moment nothing with miles so let's have a look at what it's about to do And I think what we'll do is we'll do some of these Mysterium missions. They ain't the easiest, but we'll definitely give them a wow. I'm sure you've heard by now that Mac Gargan, the Scorpion, has been found dead. His stinger removed like a trophy. One can only assume this was at the hands of the Hunter. Are they doing what the ineffectual Spider-Man won't and removing these dangers permanently? Then again, Spider maybe Spider-Man has so finally cool. changed his tune. I, for one, say, let Wait, them wipe that? each other out. Looks They're not making our mysterious. world a better place. And the less of these mass marauders roaming our streets, the better. When they're gone, a we can turn the corner back Miles to now. simpler times. Wouldn't that be refreshing? I yearn for the days of normal news coverage, when I could attack the real issues, like the tanking economy, or the corruption of our youth, instead of being forced to cover spandex buffoons who make life for the average Joe a waking nightmare. One day, <laughs> one day. Jameson is just relentless, isn't he? Let's do it. Let's switch to Miles. Let's find out what we can do. Oh, we gotta speak to these guys on the side, have we? Need some help? The Mysterium is infected with a virus or something, and it's trapped someone inside. Okay. If you execute the breakpoint condition, the system should reset. Just try not to get hurt in the process. How would I get hurt if it's just an illusion? That, my friend, is what we're trying to find out. Okay. Just need to 
feel quite finished as much as I can. Hands up! <laughs> I expect better from the amazing spider -Man. You will be mine! why they call you a superhero. Oh, you found one of our dev diaries. This is a project Betsy was passionate about. Unfortunately, more people are trapped in Mysteriums throughout the city. Oh, we must find out who is behind this and bring them to justice. This whole okay. Mysterium thing feels shady. But if there are people trapped, I gotta help them. And try to figure out what's really going on. Oh! Okay, that's Ma cool. left me a message. Miles, about the stolen museum pieces. Let's go. I went to the impound yard and saw an old phone number on that truck you chased down. I may be onto something. Can you come meet your mama for lunch at the park by my office? Chop cheese on me. Let's go. Any clue is a good clue. If we can't find that truck, the museum will have to close. Plus, I never turn out a chopped cheese. In the last episode, basically, uh, I went to a museum and one of them, and two trucks were stolen, containing musical goods. One of the trucks we got back, the second truck is still out there somewhere. So we are now going to go and see if we can find that second truck. Just to give you a bit of context, if you're wondering if you've seen the last episode and I'm thinking, well, I didn't actually see that. Let's go check out this one though. These are annoying, but we'll get them done. This one has expertly glides through the city. Okay. What is this? Help! 
Just hey! Just finish it. Where'd they go? Think you can defeat my most demanding illusion? Yeah! I die. What came up? Remember, everything's an illusion. Even that fake Mysterio. It was hard enough doing. Whoa! I'm sure it doesn't feel like an illusion. How are they doing this? Illusion is an illusion. Hmm. Okay. You've done well so far, but can you hit so you cannot see? I may be an illusion, but your pain is real. progress for midtown. We'll stop off and do one more. Just hope to god this episode's recording people. Very 
see two little spider bot. There you are. Look at you rocking the tiny fedora. Another little stir in there. We'll have a little pop at that. Hi, I'm a master of illusion. Let the Let's mystery go. begin. Is that Spider-Man? Defeat all the enemies. Help! Help! Don't worry, I'll find you. Destroy them all. <laughs> You're safe now. Got it. Oh, on the nail there. Hmm. Looks like I got a message. Spider-Man, Betsy here. Quentin and Cole are scrubbing through all the very helpful data you provided. And I was thinking, when the Mysteriums are back to operating safely, It'd be great to get a Spider-Man endorsement. Pro bono, of course. <laughs> We're running out of capital here, and it's making Quentin quite anxious. Anyway, just a thought. No need to call back. Whoever had uh, anyone fight back? Bye. Sometimes. Sorry, Betsy. We have a firm rule against Spidey endorsement. Might want to rethink that business plan. We got a gift for you, Spidey. We're ending this now. <laughs> I'm sure Feast could use some strong hands. Let's go. Think about it. Go and help some charities, guys. Be good. So, just being dickheads. Ooh, that's so high. Let's head on forward. Let's go down. Let's see what Mama wants. Let's go. So the phone number on the impounded truck was the pre-1970s kind with letters. Harlem 7, 4321. Did the truck that got away have the same one? Yeah. But I'm not sure I'm following. <laughs> Pre-1970s trucks were terrible polluters because they had no catalytic converters. My office did an initiative to get them off the roads. 
so there are now very few old trucks in this neighborhood. Si tuviéramos alguna forma de localizarlo. I got an idea. Nice work, Ma. Back in business. If Ma's right about those trucks, they probably left behind some kind of residue. Hey, Miles. I heard there's a star-studded gala at the museum. If I find the missing pieces, yeah. Never been to a gala before. Do you want to go? Thought you'd never ask. What should I wear? Here's black, Loki glam. Bro, let me focus. Right. Uh, good luck. I can't believe people would do this. I was so excited about this exhibit. The whole museum, really. Look, this is an unfortunate situation I'm in here. I mean, you know how much I care about protecting the collective history of this community. I do, which is why I hope this won't derail your support. Okay, let's see if those trucks left anything behind. Spider-Man's here. Spider-Man, any news? Working on some new leads. I'll let you know. This looks like it could be something oh, from a prehistoric okay. heist truck. Well, you know my <sighs> Me, smell that sulfur. The Definitely from an old engine. Maybe I can isolate it further. Okay. To identify the substance, we so need to get rid of the contaminants. Hey, Spider-Man. Now we know you're helping on this. You're good. Thanks. So who you rid of that one? Donna. That one there. I'm gonna have to get rid of that one. And if you go like that, that allows to get rid of that, and that allows to get rid of that. Oh shit, fast. Right. Aromatic hydrocarbon. This will never make it through a catalytic converter. Hey, Ma, you were right. That truck was so old, it left a unique contaminant in its wake. Fantastic. Can you track it down? On it as we speak. I suddenly have hope we might really be able to find everything, pull off the gala, and save the museum. Whoa, 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 whoa. One thing at a time. Okay, I know. Well, be careful, and let me know what you find. Swing away and find out what we find out. Okay. Sorry, couldn't hear you. Anyway, we delivered everything we had. Bad guys. The rest of it fell off the truck. You better freaking find it! I understand, sir. We'll keep looking for the last item. He's stiffing us. What did I tell you? No. Hmm? He'll pay when we deliver the saxophone. No, the saxophone. I think you know where. Settle down, idiot. This guy's loaded. Just need to make him happy. I am done. I'm gonna go okay. find that guy and take my money. You're gonna blow the whole deal for all of us. I'm with him. Let's go find him with the man on cash. You guys have no patience. Oh, yeah. I think I heard him. Where there's a web, there's a spider. Hey! Spider alert! He's here! I'll find him and put him down! That you bug? Come to play? Freaking webs are everywhere! When I'm through with him... And don't let the bed bugs bite. We'll find Spider-Man one way or another. We will find him. I just don't know the best way to be. I don't know if I want to be taken. I'll find him and put him down. <sighs> we 
will get the jump on him. Lights fading. The spider. Oh, someone did. You better hope I don't get to him. Just got left with that guy again. Fine. I'm right on the edge of these. Let's go. You shouldn't have shown yourself! Hey, hey, you don't... Down you go. Okay. That's all of them. Let's check the van. Let's open up that truck and get the rest of those museum pieces. Empty. They must have already given their boss whatever was in here. All roads seem to lead to that guy. Sounds like somebody's phone. Okay, so there's something out there they're still looking for. Charlie Parker sucks. So I found the second truck, but it was empty. Oh no. But they lost one of the pieces somehow. Charlie Parker saxophone. Oh, Miles, head over to C.J. Walker Park. Okay, why? One of our interns said she heard a guy talking about a saxophone he <laughs> found. I didn't believe her at first. She's. Kind of a bochichera. If this the one these guys lost, the boss seemed really interested in finding it. As he should be. Charlie Parker's a legend. That saxophone is priceless. Who should I look for at the park? I don't have a name. They said a trumpet player was talking about it. Trumpet! Got it! Thanks, Yaranita. Let me know what happens. Te quiero. Gotta Let's change go. clothes first. Don't want to disrupt the festival. I'm just gonna get right to the saxophone player. Okay. Where is this trumpet guy? Oh, trumpet guy, sorry. This place looks a lot better today than it did when Fisk and his crew took it over. Trumpet guy's over there. Thanks, everyone. Hey, Spider Man. Hello, Spider Man. Hey, Miles. Teo. Sounding good, man. Wow, I didn't know you played the trumpet. I dabble, I dabble. Hey, I was actually gonna call you. When I was in keynote music this morning getting my horn fixed, some kids brought in a sax they found on the street. I was thinking it could potentially be the one from the museum. I don't want to get anyone in trouble. They were trying to do the right thing. Yeah, a hundred percent. You talking about keynote on Cathedral? Yeah, talk to Eugene. Thanks. Headed there right now. Trumpet sounds great, bro. Cool, let's get it. Hey, Ma. Found the sax. On my way to pick it up now. Ay, bendito. Angela will be so relieved. This just might save the museum. Hey, did you know Teo played the trumpet? He's pretty good, too. Got an audience and everything. The whole park was bumping. Precisely why this museum is so important. Music enriches our community and brings it together. Is that my mom or Councilwoman Morales talking? It's both. Ten cuidado, amigo. Okay. Uh-oh. This doesn't look good. Hey, Spider-Man! I was about to put an alert in your app. Fair place. What happened here? Uh, look at A couple that. of creepy guys just dragged Eugene out of here. Definitely wasn't right. They went that way. Thanks. I'll check it out. Let's scan for any clues here. Sledgehammer? Oh, these guys meant business. Scuff marks. Looks like Eugene might have been dragged that way. I don't know what you're talking about. Come on, just tell us where it is. Stop making this difficult. Why would I have Charlie Parker's sax in my little shop? That should be in the museum. We know you have the sax. Tell us where it is. I swear on you. Hey, fellas, you want to learn to play music? 
There are better ways to do it. That is true. Man, here comes the rest of them. Hope you guys long enough to get the spider! <laughs> Spider-Man. You okay? A few bruises are okay. As long as they left me my keys. A few bruises Here, are okay. Take these and open my trunk. You open the trunk. Oh, he has got Charlie Parker's thing. Charlie Parker's saxophone. That's, so That's the real deal right there. I was getting ready to return to the museum, and those guys busted in. Dickheads. Yeah, he used that to record his masterpiece, Ornithology, 1946. You a bird fan? <laughs> My dad was. I don't know much about old music. Mm, mm, oh. <laughs> when you hear an MC today, you syncopated accents, stress the offbeat, flow in and out of the rhythm. Hey, number bebop. I have to listen a little closely next time. I'll get this back to the museum right away. Then I gotta call my insurance company. Okay. Thanks, man. Right. Hmm. If I could get into the phone these guys were using to communicate with the mastermind. <laughs> All zeros is a number equivalent of password as a password. Just a midnight rendezvous with a criminal mastermind. Skip it about beep boop boo. I don't love that beep bop. I said I scat about beep bop, but beep it about beep beep. Build a new gadget, concussion blood burst. Oh, let's build two new gadgets. Ricochet web. And we'll up shoot. Oh, we'll, up s we'll do some of the skills on our web shooters. And we will also, we got one more skill point. Ended that mission. Oh, here Who's we this? go. Time to take down the boss of this operation and find the rest of those museum pieces. Let's do it. Let's swing and glide our way there. Top of that building, though. This for a start. Always handy to get. Nice work, Miles. I'm not gonna just ripping it off. And where is that to? It's letting off out of a little blast. It's close. There it is. Come to Papa. You know how to rack a scarf. Hey, get this. It looks like these imposter spider bots are getting pinged by some third party. Like someone else is tracking them? Exactly. 
Oh, hold on. Okay, didn't think he didn't have to rush away. I was happy to wait, but mission time. No one time. here yet. I'll just hang for a bit until the party starts. Let's do it. You were supposed to pay us on our last delivery. You'll get paid when I get everything. Where is it? Where is what? Lewis said you were bringing the saxophone. Lewis said? Lewis got picked up by the cops. He don't got no saxophone. You set this meeting up! No, we didn't. Now where's our money? Where is the saxophone? Aaron? The big donor from the museum? Better bust up this party and have a talk with him. Okay. I should get the whole bunch wrapped up before they hurt someone. We're fed up with you not paying us. We don't work for free. I think maybe we need to show you how we feel. With our fists! Uh, yeah, hang on there! We should have never trusted you in the first place! What are you even doing here? If you're not gonna pay us... Take down, right? Look, it's Spider Man! What's he doing here? We need Leon with the big gun! Santa's still on the way! Spider Man, help me! I'm just trying to get the stolen thing back to the museum! That's not true! I can explain! That's gonna have to be a longer conversation! God's face! Sticking people up that walls. seems to be all of them. Let's get to the bottom of this with Darren. Hey, Darren. Oh, thank you, Spider-Man. I assure you, there's a very reasonable explanation. Right, look at him. That seems extremely dubious. Wait till Councilwoman Morales hears you were involved in this. Leon, here! Time to oh, exterminate shit. the spider. Darren, stay back. Are you kidding me? He was right here. 
I still have his number. Sounds like he's close. That hurts. That guy's on Darren's tail. Can't blame him. He wants their money. Who is it? Is this Lewis? Darren, stop the car! Spider-Man? Can you at least stop these guys chasing me? You weren't trying to retrieve those things. You were the one behind the robbery in the first place. I care about these objects! You pretended to care, and then stole from the museum. It's this community's history. It's my family's history. Let's go, come on. I don't expect you to understand. I don't think I'm the one who doesn't understand. Let's get these other bad guys out the way first. We gotta stop this and put all these guys behind bars. Including Darren. Almost. Got it. Hit him with all you got! Police are on their way. We gotta catch up to Darren. Oh, are you still there? Look, my father was one of the most successful music producers ever. He produced half the artists in that museum. Good for him. Now stop the car and tell me where the rest of the pieces are. Absolutely, do a down scream. So that's horrific. I remember which one was the break. Miles. I should probably get my license one of these days. Just so I get this right. All that talk of supporting the museum. All Angela's time you wasted asking about operations and security. All lies. So you can learn how to steal the collection. But my family. No. I'm sure you do care about this music. But those things don't belong to you. They belong to this community. Let's go, sir. You're under arrest. This event would not have been possible without our wonderful curator, Angela, know, Angela. and this entire community. The way we pulled together to recover the stolen items is nothing less than amazing. Okay, okay. Thanks to everyone of you for saving us. And thank you, Rio Morales, our city council person, who championed this event with so I should finish looking around before I go talk to Ma and head out. Thank you all. Thank you so much. <laughs> Angela told me the museum has a record number of Ma, new memberships. Okay. Seriously? They're gonna be okay. <laughs> Couldn't have done it without you, Ma. Now hear me out. What if we really teamed up on the next one? I can get my own suit. Ma! Maybe. Algo con brillo. Ma, stop. Stop. <laughs> stop it. Get out of here. <laughs> Dance with me. Show me how to salsa. Miles. Oh, we got a cool new suit unlocked as well. Hey, get this. It looks like these imposter spider bots are getting pinged by some third party. Like someone else is tracking them? Exactly. I just need to figure out who. <laughs> Collect any others you can find. I need all the data I can get. Nice one, Genki. Got us one step closer to solving this thing. Cool beans. Uh, we will end this episode here, guys. I just want to end it just to make sure that this recording's actually done. I don't want to go too far in. 
and not have anything bloody recorded or it'd be stuttery or crap like the last episode when we have to record it again. Danicasters, uh, you remember those recent thefts at the Harlem Cultural Center? Turns out... Out, Darren Shipman was pulling the strings. <laughs> If that name sounds familiar, it's because he's a multi-millionaire with his name on everything, because his money is in everything. So, we have a special guest today to drop some knowledge on us about an exciting new opportunity for budding artists to share in the joys of responsible art. Please welcome renowned street artist and head of the Cooper Art Coalition, Haley Cooper. Hi, Danica. I'm Genki Lee, Haley's interpreter. She's signing next to me. She says she's concerned. Oh, excited <laughs> to be here. Ugh, I'm still learning. <laughs> Fantastic. Welcome, both of you. So, Haley, tell us all about your co. Maybe help. Jeez, these guys oh. are uptight. Guess they know about the other two blinds. That was my fault. I want to say about the, pod, uh, about the podcast. I saw you. The other two blind are down. Because of the spider. He's hunting. Oh, come on. Get up. Style. Boom! That's the last blind. Gotta get in there and... My Harlem? Hunter's about to find out there's a new Shogun in town. Oh! That's the abandoned school that my mom keeps trying to get repaired. That's their base? Okay, that's cool. Someone has to let them know school's out of session. For good. That is cool. So, gang, as I was saying, I think I will leave it there. And we'll be back with the next episode very, very soon. So, thank you very much for watching. Much love for me. And peace.